Well, unexpected stop for me today. Unfortunately, I'm out at discount tire. Why? Going through my storage unit, doing a scavenging thing, and wouldn't you know it, heard a little pop, and then a click, click, click as I was driving. Yep, damn screw right in the middle of my drag radial. And now this is a pretty easy repair. I have plug kits, I've done it before. It would probably make a good video, but my storage unit is literally right there behind those trees. So I'm right next to discount tires. So I was like, well, it'd be better to get it fixed properly, which is the proper way is to get it patched. And that involves pulling the tire off the wheel and throwing the patch on there. And you know, might as well rebalance and all that. So that's where we're at, sucks, but oh well. All right, dude just got in my car. This will be the first time I've had someone unexpectedly go into a gutted car with a Kirky seat and no trim panels. So this will be funny here is a reaction. Yeah, I was telling you it was gutted. <laughs> you all right being on YouTube? Yeah. <laughs> Basically open it. You just got to hold this. Well, tight, you just pull it like that. All right, man. Or we just uh, turn it on really quick. Oh, yeah, you can't roll that one down. Oh, you can. And just open it like that. Yeah, or you can do that. All right. Always weird seeing someone else drive your car, you know? Sounds like they're done and about to pull it out. All right, and I am back at my storage unit where the screw happened. Luckily, I didn't get a second screw. I was honestly worried as I came back, would I get a second screw immediately after? But just so you could see how close I am, there's a discount tire right there. So it was right next to me. And that's why I went, got it done, taking care of right away. Again, I could plug it. I do have plug kits, I've done plugs, but a patch is always better than a plug, especially since these are my drag radials and I don't always track them, but sometimes I do. And hopefully you can see it, but there, there it is, right there. So it looks a little bit rough. It'll wear down as, as I use it, but for the patch, they actually pull the wheel off, take the tire off, patch it, and then put the tire back on. And the best thing is with Discount Tire, the repair is actually free. I didn't buy those tires from them because those are the ones that came on my car from the factory. Now I am a customer of theirs. I do buy other tires. This car's been there because I had that video where I did the front swap. So they did these tires on here, but it doesn't matter. Even if you don't buy your tires there, they do repairs for free. And that's kind of the other reason I decided to do this video, even though it's really short, to let you know if you get a screw in your tire, you need a tire repair, Discount Tire will take care of it for free. Now, obviously, I got lucky. It was right in the center, so you could fix it. If it's like at the edge or sidewall, then they can't fix it. So, discount tires is the best option there, unless you just get a new tire or if you have their tire certificates, which I do. So, even if my well, actually, I wouldn't have tire certificates on these because these are factory, but I do always buy them because they've always that's the one insurance warranty type thing that's paid out for me, and I always get it. Uh, so I do have them on that. So if those picked up a screw and they were on the edge and it needed to be replaced, it would be replaced for free while well, I would have to buy a new certificate. And so now I can get back to my scavenging and then head home because I was doing this during my lunch break and my lunch break turned out to be a lot longer. So thanks for watching this short little quick video. Hope you don't ever need a tire repair, but let's face it, you probably will at some point. At least you now you know you can get it done in Tuscan Tire for free. So like, comment, subscribe, all the good stuff, and see you at the drag strip.